Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna to look at Thumbtipedia, a new DVD from Vernet Magic. What is it? Well, basically it's your thumb tip encyclopedia. If you've ever uh, had a thumb tip and thought, well, the only thing I can do with this is vanish a silk, there's so much more you can do with that little secret utility. Let's watch the trailer. All right, so that was Thumbtippedia from Vernet. A couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews, and the first of which is, what's in the box? What's in the box? You're gonna get the thumb tip gimmick, okay? You're gonna get a DVD. Now the DVD is available to watch in both Spanish and English, and it's about 90 minutes. What's the overall quality and production value of the video? Uh, the performer, uh, I, no, I can't pronounce his name. I know his name, can't pronounce it. <laughs> uh, he's offering you a studio performance. It's all studio performance and he does even his explanations all in the same place. So he's standing against a red curtain. Uh, most of the entire video is performing for a stationary camera. He has a couple of close-up shots for detail, and it is a well-made DVD. Is the gimmick well-made? Uh, it is a very good, uh, I would say medium to small thumb tip, which was a little odd for me because most of the effects on the DVD, I would say the majority of them are performed with a king size thumb tip. So I just think it would have made more sense if they had given you that model instead of the smaller one, but it's no big deal. All right, so what are some of the tricks that they teach on the video? Uh, you're gonna learn the cut and restored rope. You're gonna learn the cut and restored silk from a newspaper tube. Uh, the vanishing heap of salt. Uh, a vanishing lit cigarette. Color changing silk. Signed silk from a dinner roll. Uh, you're gonna learn a variation on the 20th century silks. You'll learn how to make a goldfish appear out of thin air. Uh, the silk becomes an egg trick. The silk travels from one hand to the other. Uh, silk from my coin purse clasp. Uh, balancing a card on the back of your hand. That one's a pretty cool one. Uh, torn and restored newspaper. Vanishing an extra large silk. And you're also gonna learn the mismade bill trick, which would be transforming a $1 bill into a $100 bill. Of course, there's a ton more. I don't wanna give them all the way, but that's just a small sampling of what you could expect to learn. Positives, what are the positives to Thumbtippedia? You know, I can't even imagine a better entry level introduction even exists on the thumb tip than this one. Uh, Vernet has put together a complete foundation. I wish I had this when I was starting out. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives to Thumbtippedia? Uh, I prob it probably could have been just a tad bit longer. Um, not that 90 minutes is not enough time. I think they could have added a couple of more things just to make this a complete resource, um, you know, how to wear your thumb tip. Some people get that wrong. They think, you know, it should be worn a certain way and it really shouldn't. Uh, maybe even care, you know, how do you care for your thumb tip? How do you store it? Um, if you were to go to the store, how would you buy your own? What are some suggestions from professionals about what they notice when they go to purchase one? Uh, just what to look for. I think uh, just some wear and care tips uh, I think would have been a bigger help. Is it worth your money? Hey, you know, it's only 25 bucks. 25 bucks for a 90 minute introduction plus you get a thumb tip, it's totally well worth your money. If you wanna get into thumb tip magic or you wanna learn more than just how to vanish a silk, I would get this. Who would like this? You know, for the most part, these are uh, beginner level effects, okay? They are. And I would suggest that if you got a thumb tip and a silk and you really don't know what to do beyond that, then this would be a great resource. Um, I had a book 
I had a book a long time ago when I was a kid, and a lot of these uh, effects that are in this video are in that book, but it's nice to see them. You know, it's nice to see them visually and get a couple of tips that go beyond the book. Um, I haven't seen uh, as many resources for the thumb tip out there as maybe there should be, and so definitely think if you're getting into magic or you're, you're, you haven't bought a thumb tip yet, this would be a great resource for you to pick up. All right, so that is Thumbtipedia from Vernay. I wanna thank Murphy's Magic for allowing me to have this trick so that I can do the review for you. And if you would like to purchase this trick for yourself, you can find it from one of your very favorite Murphy's Magic retailers. Thanks, bye.